Hey everyone, this is the Untwisted Voice. Thanks for stopping by and watching my video blog. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? I'd really appreciate it. What this video is about today is about Metamucil powder versus Metamucil capsules. I've used both of these products over the last two years, two and a half years, off and on. And I just want to say that both these products are terrific. They work a little different when it comes to constipation issues, but both of them work for constipation and they're both, both terrific. I want to start off by talking about the pill. Both of these products are full of silicon husk, which is a natural soluble fiber. What helps everybody go to the washroom. Fiber helps everybody have a healthy bowel movement. These products are loaded with fiber, a natural plant food called psyllium husk. The one difference between the capsule and the powder is that there's no additives in the capsule. The only additive is, is it contains gelatin and I would, rem and I would think it's because it's a binding agent to hold things together. In the powder, there is artificial flavoring and artificial colorings. And if you order the one with non-sugar, uh, with no sugar in it, it has aspartame in it. And for some people, aspartame, artificial coloring, and artificial flavoring is very, very harmful to them. So just to let you know that, that's, that's one of the big difference between the capsule and the powder. So if you want a 100% natural product when it comes to silicon husk or metamucil, I would strongly suggest that you take the pill. Another thing about the pill is that you have to take large amounts of water with it and you have to take five of these four times a day. I find that to be a lot to take. It's a lot, it's 20 capsules. The pills themselves cost about $23 Canadian for 300 of them. So if you're taking that amount of pills each day, you're gonna spend about $50 a month on your fiber intake when it comes to Metamucil. It's a little more pricier than the powder. This powder cost me $12 to $13 and I just find it goes a little longer throughout the month using it as directed. One tablespoon, three times a day. The, the powder itself tends to go a little further. But one, another thing about the pill that I really like, they're very convenient. They're easy to take throughout the day. You don't have to stop like the powder, put it in a glass, mix it up really quick and drink it. So there's a lot more to do with the powder. The one thing about the pills, you can take them throughout the day and get your daily fiber requirement. It's just a little easier to, to take and you still get the effect of it. But the bonus about the pill, that, the capsule that I like, is your pills, your poops are more firmer. They're not as so urgent. When it comes to the powder, you may take it now, like an hour, like right now, then an hour later have to go. So if you're using the powder, your poops will come a little more urgent. They really will. So I suggest if you're using the powder for the first time, hang around the house a little bit. Don't go out golfing or go to the theater or wherever you want to go because it's going to be an inconvenience. But I don't find I get that sense of urgency when I use the capsule. It's, it's more regular. I can feel the urge to go to the washroom. Not so rushed that I have to run to the toilet like I get from the powder. So that's a real, really big thing about it. Another thing about the powder that's kind of annoying that I, that I found is that if you use the powder, see the powder here? If you set it in here, say you can't drink a full eight ounce glass of water, you need to drink it, like take you about 15 minutes to drink it. The powder starts, the silicon husk, starts to form, it starts to gelatize, or gelatize, gelatize is not even a word. It starts to get jelly-like, so people might gross people out. And that's one thing about the powder that's sort of a bit of a hassle. You have to take it, mix it up really quick, and drink it really quick. Some people may have a problem with that. So that's a downer about the powder. I prefer the powder myself. I just find it, I take it at night, I go to sleep, I wake up in the morning, and I go to the washroom to help me, and I, and I get a great feeling that I've, I've passed all my stool and I feel empty. That's, that's how I take the powder. I take it at night, and I only take it once a day. I take it at night. It's worked really, really effective for me. Another thing I want to talk about is the health benefits from using Metamucil. 
Both of these products will help you lower your blood sugar levels and they will also help you with cholesterol. But the added benefit you get from using Metamucil powder is that it can help you with weight loss. It's really, really true and it's proven. It can help you with weight loss. It is very, very simple to explain. The silicon husk itself is a soluble fiber that expands in the GI tract. So when you drink the Metamucil, when it goes into your stomach, it expands. That's why they tell you to take large amounts of water with it, because it expands and it uses up a lot of water. So if you take it 15 or 20 minutes before you eat, it'll give you that feeling that you're not hungry or you're not as hungry as you thought you were. So because of that, it will help you with weight loss. That is a proven fact. You don't get that benefit when it comes to the capsule. You don't get that benefit at all with the capsule. I don't know why it doesn't work the same way, but it's just a fact about the Metamucil powder versus the Metamucil capsule. Myself, I prefer, I prefer the powder over the capsule, but I use the capsule when I travel, or I use the capsule when my life gets busier and I'm outside a lot, out of the house a lot, I tend to use the capsule. I give both of these products, well, I give the powder an eight, because it has the additives to it, and I give the capsules a 10 out of 10 because they do exactly what they claim they do and they don't have additives. They're both great products for constipation, but I just wanna tell you one little thing before I end the video. If you are on any other medications and you are thinking about using Metamucil, by all means, please go and see your doctor before you start taking Metamucil because it may come in conflict with the medications that you're already on. And also, if your constipation lasts for more than three days, again, go and see your doctor. There might be something else going on that's making you constipated. So go and see your doctor. Do not take advice from me off a video on YouTube or from Dr. Google or your friends. If you're having problems with constipation on a long period of time or you're on, medi or you're on medication, go and see your doctor. It really let that person know what's going on, okay? I just want to say that to you before the, I, I end the video. So thank you very much for watching. If you have any comments, please leave them below. If you have any questions, Please leave, a, please leave a question below if I can help you. I most definitely will. This is the untwisted voice of Terry G. And as usual, look after yourself because it shows. Have a great day and I'll see you next time. Oh, by the way, one last thing. If you're thinking of purchasing either the powder or the capsules, there's links below to Amazon. Go there, click on those links, purchase it from Amazon. It'll help sponsor my, my channel. Thank you very much and have a great day. Thank you.